Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and let's get right into today's video. Before we begin, I would like to give Model Ones a big thank you for sponsoring today's video. They did go ahead and send over some PR uh, products for me to go ahead and review for you guys. And these products are on their Amazon storefront and Prime Day is July 16th and 17th. So be sure to check out the links in my description box below. They are going to have some huge savings so make sure you go ahead and check them out. You will be able to use the code on screen to save 10% on some products and I will make sure to leave those products linked in the description box below so make sure you go ahead and check them out. For the first product that I'm going to go ahead and open up it is the Model Ones Pink gel nail polish kit and it has six different colors it does have hot pink tones neon pink shades and magenta light soft to dark upon opening the package you will receive this product catalog and if you open it up it does say that model ones has become one of the most popular nail brands worldwide covering more than 30 plus countries and it also says that Model Ones has established meaningful relationships with each and every one of our 10 million users worldwide. Their products are low smell, 11 toxin free, and high gloss shine. This little catalog shows that they have tools and essentials, nail care, new nail art, poly gel, and also gel nail polish and even they have acrylic powder and dip powder and they also sell press on nails as well and they even have regular nail polish and solid cream gel so i would go ahead and just visit their amazon storefront and just take a look and see at all their different products maybe you'll find something that you'll be interested in if you're starting your own press on nail business or you want to just start doing your own nails at home model ones is a great company to go ahead and start with I have tried their poly gel kit in the past when I first started doing nails and I absolutely loved it. The formula of their poly gel was not too stiff and it wasn't too soft either and I would always use just regular 91% alcohol with it and it works perfectly. So if you're into poly gel, I highly recommend you pick up their poly gel kits. I have never used any of their gel polish before. I've only used their base coat and their top coat which came in the poly gel kit so I'm really excited to go ahead and try them out today and also upon opening the package it does give you this instruction manual so if you've never used gel polish before this is a very thorough instruction booklet it also comes with answers to questions that you may have I am going to go ahead and pull the bottles out of the packaging. The packaging is just this plastic case and you can go ahead and toss this if you like. It's really not that high quality but the packaging part doesn't matter. What matters is the gel polish of course. So like I said it does come with six different colors and I am going to go ahead and swatch these for you and I'll be back here in a bit.
okay here are all six colors swatched for you these gel polishes were pretty pigmented and i only used one coat they did self-level really nice and didn't have any harsh smells to them I am going to go ahead and use these pink gel polishes in today's design so be sure to stick around to see. The next product that they sent me is the Model 1 7 in 1 Clear Builder Nail Gel. The 7 things that you can do with this builder gel is it's a nail enhancement apex building extension gel nail shaping base coat and rhinestone gel and also you can use it as a nail glue gel i have been looking for a good builder gel to add strength to my press on nails so i am going to go ahead and test this product out today in my nail design as well as you can see it's not too thick and it's not too thin it has a nice consistency in my opinion and the fact that it comes in a 15 ml bottle is great for easy application this product also comes with a thorough instruction manual if you have never used builder gel before The last product they sent to me is the Nude Pink Gel Polish Set, perfect for all skin tones. When I opened up the bottles, I was excited to see the colors because I could definitely use these for when I'm doing my character nail art and need different skin tones, so this set is so perfect for that. And the brown ones, they also reminded me of like melted chocolate, you know when your candy bar melts in the car or something and you open it they looked so yummy i don't recommend you eating these gel polishes of course but i will go ahead and swatch these for you and i'll be back here in a bit And here's the six colors this new gel polish set comes with. I'll have to use these in another video. Thank you again Model Ones for sending over these products for me to try. They are highly pigmented as well and I did go ahead and just use one coat for each of these swatch rings. So I highly recommend if you are looking for some new gel polishes go ahead and pick this up for yourself. So to get started with the design, I am going to go ahead and use these full cover almond nail tips that I got from Timu. They are kind of thin as you can see, so I can't wait to see what the Model Ones Builder Gel does to these nails to make them stronger. 
So first step that I do with my press-ons is I go ahead and add a thin layer of my acid-free primer instead of buffing. This helps me save time and with my carpal tunnel it does save my wrists a lot of you know not feeling any pain so if you have never tried using primer on your press-ons instead of buffing i highly recommend that you go ahead and give it a try and as my base coat i am going to go ahead and use the builder gel because remember this is a seven in one so base coat is listed as one of the you know the things that you can use this builder gel for so i am going to go ahead and apply a thin layer of this builder gel on all the nails after the primer has air dried for about a minute and I will go ahead and cure this for 60 seconds in the nail lamp. So I did want to go ahead and use all six colors for this nail design so I decided to go ahead and make some abstract nail art today. I will be using a long liner brush and I will cure in between each color that I use for about 30 seconds. You just want to make sure that your lines don't mix with each other unless you're going for that marble look but I'll let you go ahead and enjoy watching this process and I'll come back here in a bit. I did forget to mention that I am going to go ahead and paint all the nails one solid color the whole you know the whole entire nail. I will paint it one solid color which was this lighter pink and then after that I will go ahead and cure for 60 seconds just to make sure that it's well cured and then after that's done I will go ahead and start with the nail art with the liner brush and I will put all other five colors on my nail palette and I will just go ahead ahead and just randomly pick the colors but I do like I said go ahead and make sure that I incorporate all six colors somehow in this nail design so that you can go ahead and see what they look like and I just can't wait for you to see the design so go ahead and enjoy see you in a bit
I did want to quickly mention that I have, like I said, been behind in my videos because me and my family, you know, we're really busy right now this time of the year. And unfortunately, I'm not able to upload as often as I would like. So I did want to just mention, you know, more videos are coming if you're new to my channel. Um, please make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. And thank you to all my subscribers that are subscribed to my channel. Please hang in there, okay? I appreciate all of you. I appreciate you guys supporting my channel. And just because I'm not uploading as often doesn't mean I'm going anywhere. I really, really, really love making press on nails. Like, I just, I can't stop doing it, you know, by choice. Like, I will never stop making press on nails, whether it's for an order or it's for you know my friends or it's just for content so please know that I appreciate all of you for being here supporting me and I do want to mention that I've had a couple subscribers request you know some type of video for me to make and I do want you to know that I have not forgotten about you you are on my list it's just you know I, I am trying to get these PR package videos you know going because I am behind and sometimes your request that you have asked me to recreate just I don't know like they just don't go with the package if that makes sense like for example I've had a subscriber ask me to make some Starbucks drinks nails and that is such a great idea I, I cannot wait to do those believe me it is on my list to do like I will get it done I promise you it is just taking me you know longer than than expected so I do apologize for that I have not forgotten about you but if you just have patience with me here soon I will be able to go ahead and upload more videos more frequently and that time will come where I will go ahead and post that video so don't worry but don't forget okay to subscribe to my channel if you're new if you've never been here before thank you for stopping by make sure you like the video and make sure that you turn on your notifications so you don't miss out on any of my uploads for when I do upload and I did want to go ahead and just thank again all of you guys for being here if you are still here watching please go ahead and leave an emoji down below or leave a comment of your choice if you're feeling generous anything just to let me know that you're still here supporting me and you've made it this far I know this is like one of my longest videos I've done I don't know if you guys like longer videos you like shorter videos you know you can go ahead and let me know that as well in the comment section what you guys like to watch i personally go back and forth um i can watch short videos i can watch longer videos i'm actually both i'm really not picky so let me know what you guys enjoy and i will see if i can go ahead and meet you know your requests as well but as um getting back to the products of the video sorry I got off track um, I did go ahead and apply that builder gel once again as some added strength to the nail and I did cure for 60 seconds and me personally I hold the nail stand upside down as you see just so that the gel can go ahead and pull to the center and I get lazy like I don't like to file nails and also you know like I said with my carpal tunnel it's it's just so hard for me to file I I have really bad carpal tunnel and the less filing that I have to do the better so that's what I do I just go ahead and hold the nail stand upside down so that the gel goes ahead and like centers you know in the middle of the nail and creates a really nice apex and I was noticing that 
this uh, builder gel after I cured it for 60 seconds it was sticky but it was not that sticky if that makes sense like it was as sticky as like a regular base coat which is great I was so excited for that because I've used other builder gels in the past and they are extremely sticky like I was using the savvy land builder gel and I love it because it's so thick but at the same time after you cure it's so sticky so this model one seven in one builder gel is a great option for you to go ahead and try if you want to go ahead and use some builder gel again i did use it as a base coat and then i did go ahead and use it as added strength for my press on nails and after i cured it i did go ahead and just wipe off the sticky layer which was not bad remember but i still went ahead and wiped off the sticky layer with some 91 percent alcohol and a paper towel and now I am going to go ahead and apply my no wipe top coat. This top coat is from Betsy. You can use any non wipe top coat that you happen to have. This was just closest to me. So I went ahead and used it. And I am showing you really quick how I apply my nails, you know, for my nail content when I'm, you know, filming. Um, I just use this like wax. It's like a wax sheet that I got with some nail stands and i just put a little bit underneath the press on and then i just press down on my nail i don't you know i don't uh what do you call it prep them or anything i'm just filming content and taking pictures like that's all i'm doing when i do this so i just go ahead and put it on and as you can see the pink colors from this gel polish set were just so pretty like i could not believe how well these colors just all mixed together like they all just i loved them i think they all just went well together period like i highly recommend you go ahead and pick up this polish set as i said before i will go ahead and leave links in the description box below for you to go ahead and visit amazon storefront for model one make sure you use my link so you can go ahead and save you some money on your purchase and i hope you enjoyed today's video don't forget about amazon prime day which is july 16th and the 17th so make sure you go and check them out thanks for being here i'll see you in the next one don't forget to like and share and subscribe bye